Hi, I'm Steve. I'm Felicia. And this is our review of Epigo. Epigo. Like EpiPen. Or the beginning of Ego. Or Mini Go. It's ancient Ego. So or started... Hop and Go. Epigo is a two player strategy game in which players make moves, three at a time. In the box, you'll find. The game boards on which he'll challenge other players, Epigo tiles with numbers on them, action tiles also with numbers on them and arrows, the X tile which is used in setup and in variant gameplay, and finally the slam action, which is also for variant rules. The player to push out three of his opponent's tiles off the board wins. Here's how to set up the game. Each player chooses a color and gets the tiles and action cards. Then on the center line, each player places their epigo tiles face down in any spot. Then all players reveal their standing line and remove the X tile from the game. You're now ready to play. Each player now chooses three of their action cards and face them in the direction they want that number to move. Once each player has made a stack of three action tiles, they both reveal one at the same time. The top action shows your current move. The highest number will move first, then the lowest. If there is a tie, they are both cancelled. This is good in case you need to stop him from making a move. The cards on top go back into your hand and the next move is played. Do this for three cards in the action stack. When all three played, repeat this process until one of the players has pushed out three of the opponent's tiles. You can also push a line of tiles, as long as you have equal or more tiles than the opponent does. Also, you can move two spaces instead of one, if your tile is never adjacent to an opponent's tile. The action mechanic of this game kind of reminds me of Wings of War. The game is alright and good for people who like chess and want to try something new. The bluffing part of Epigo is also fun and anticipating your player's moves are crucial to winning. It's fun to see how your move can completely foil your opponent's plan. It's easy to teach and the games aren't very long. The variant rules also help the game keep its freshness. The box size is awkward and annoying to travel with, yet it keeps the board unfolded. The rule book is good with examples of play and pushes. We're giving Epigo a solid 7 out of 10.